So I have just watched Jesse J absolutely snatching whatever edges, whatever head top, just taking everything from me in terms of joy. Well, no, actually not taking, she actually gave me so much joy. It was amazing. Like, I can't get over how amazing that was. That was so good. And I can't believe it's been five years that's been out there and I've never seen that, which is absolutely shocking shocking um but we're you know we're on a journey to kind of rectify that so i'm i'm, I'm doing the best i can <laughs> uh, so the next one in the list was um her singing earth well fla flashlight um and earth song so uh, i'm trying to think did she oh see her wrote that i did not see her wrote flashlight that's pretty cool um and Sam Smith as well. I did not know that. I did not know that at all. Uh, and then Earth Song, which obviously written by Michael Jackson. I can't actually remember how Flashlight goes. I keep thinking... That's Domino though, isn't it? And obviously Earth Song. What have we done to the world? What have we done? which I think is a very valid question even for today. Um, so yeah, the waste of the time, let's jump straight into this. This is Jesse J singing, I don't know if it's gonna be a mashup or two separate songs of uh, Flashlight and Earth Song. Jet shit jet. Jackson. Jackson. 光是在這個舞台上就有李文、張傑和蒂瑪西三位歌手演唱過,這麼經典的歌曲肯定要喝著天籁之音天賜遊記的經典遊記奶欣賞才過癮,對吧?對。She's really as an artist and as a person, I'm very about people. One more time. The band's like, what about all this? That's to get the audience involved. This week, I definitely wanted to step out of my comfort zone for myself and the audience and take a risk. Okay. Music is the only global language. What I've been given the chance to do is bridge a gap between two cultures and creating an atmosphere with myself and the audience and have a moment where we can really remember and, and feel that musically. Hello everybody, my name is Karma Ellie. I'm so the Minister for Culture and Education in the British Embassy in Beijing. It's very exciting in this week when we have the British Prime Minister Theresa May is visiting China. She's promoting cultural exchange between our two countries. Jessie J is a fantastic example of that cultural exchange. She mentioned that everywhere she goes, she sees herself as representing the UK, and we see herself, her like that as well. We're very proud of her. On behalf of the British Embassy, the British Ambassador, we would like to wish Jessie J every success in Singer Programme. Oh, that's a really cool thing to get that kind of support, man, from your country. That's really awesome. Come through, green suit. <laughs> She's just so unapologetically herself. I love that about her. Okay. When tomorrow comes, I'll be on my own Feeling frightened of the things that I don't know When tomorrow comes, tomorrow comes, tomorrow comes Whoa. And though the road is long, I look 
look up to the sky And in the dark I found Lost hope that I won't fly And I sing along I sing along I sing along Wow I got all I need when I got you and I I look around me and see a sweet light I'm stuck in the dark but you're my flashlight You're getting me, getting me through the night I haven't heard this song for so long when you shine it in my eyes in light It's a sweet light Stuck in the dark with you my flashlight You're getting me, getting me through my life Wow uh, Every time she sings I just get goosebumps And that was a nice all mm. What about sunrise? What about rain? What about all the things that you said we were to gain? Mm. What about killing fields? Ooh. Is there a time? What about all the things that you said were yours and mine? Did you ever stop to notice all the blood you shed before? Did you ever stop to notice this crying earth, these weeping shores? Ah. Wow. Ooh. Sing it with me, come on. Ah. If I was there, I'd be singing right now, I'm telling you that. <laughs> That you played your only son Woo! What about flowering fields? Is there a time? What about all the dreams That you said were yours and mine? Did you ever stop to notice All the people dead from war? Did you ever stop to notice This crying earth, these weeping shells? Wow. <laughs> that was sickening. What have we done to the world? Look what we've done. That you played your only son. And you played your only son. What about flowering fields? Is there a time? What about all the dreams that you said were yours and mine? Come on! What about us? What about yesterday? What about us? What about us? How can he breathe? Come on, what about us? Can't you see the children dying? Well, what about us? Can't you hear them cry? Well, what about us? Someone tell me where did we go wrong? What about us? Someone tell me why? What about us? Dang! <laughs> I mean, 
是一个小彩蛋。哈哈哈哈哈哈哈哈！哎，哈哈哈哈哈哈！谢谢，谢谢。哎，这谢谢说的很标准。对对对。Man, I love these guys so much, and I love you all too. Ah, thank you, 谢谢。正好享受这个舞台啊！ Come on！ 但是整个结构颠覆性的。Like I just can't stop smiling. And I can't get in. I love the haircut. Like that's it. 谢谢我们自粉贴心的。Oh, sit down. That was fun. It was different from the last few weeks. Yeah. Like I wasn't so. It was like a concert. I wasn't so um clean. Audience are waving their hands like that. They sang. Yeah. They were. What about us? It was like a show. It was. It was more of a feeling vibe than a vocal performance. I mean, you know what's mad to me that she's that she can make it. She's actually making a differentiation between a feeling performance and a vocal performance when the vocal sounded like that. Don't get me wrong. I understand what she what she what she's saying about yo. I was like feeling it more than it being like a um like I'm gonna try and show stop my vocals or whatever. But I'm like mate. <laughs> I don't know whether you're hearing what we're all hearing because to me the vocals were absolutely vocalizing. That was incredible, and I think like what was nice for me is that like I actually didn't remember fla um, how flashlight went, and now I need to go back and listen to flashlight again because it's like that's a beautiful song. That is that's an absolutely beautiful song. But then to blend that into Earth song. That that was amazing, but like again to start it off like that, like there's a, there's definitely a confidence I'm seeing that uh, to be honest, I think I saw it within Domino and I saw it with I Am Nothing, definitely with Killing Me Softly, but with this performance as well, like where she's just like growing even more. But I say growing even more, but she's still coming at at a point where it's like yo Jessie J, for me she's that girl. Do you know I mean she's that girl who you, if you if you had to say like who's someone that you would want to go and grab a drink with. Listen to their concert and then go grab a drink with afterwards. Yeah, like you're telling me it wouldn't be her because for me it 100% would be like she seems like such just just a real. As I said, I follow her on Instagram and stuff, and whenever like she posts stuff, she's posting. It's not even like it's just for her. Like she's posting for other people too. And I guess again, she probably sees herself as like a bit of a beacon for people that don't have the, the platform, the voice, the confidence to kind of speak out for themselves and like. You can just see how that comes through in her in her performances. Like, I'm now seeing quite clearly what I mean. Again, I haven't seen anyone else from this season, so I don't want to you know cast any aspersions on anybody else. But for me, if I was coming like at this point now after after performance number four, I would just be waiting for her. Like I, as much as anyone else is sick here, I'm waiting for Jesse. Like, what is Jesse coming with? Because you you're kind of changing it up. Like these arrangements. Like even the I haven't had time to even talk about. It. The actual arrangement of the song, like Earth song, like the, again, it went through phases. It wasn't like a quick little snippet of something, you know. Um, the, the, it's I can't believe that she was like, this is just a feeling performance. There were so many vocals, like that she demonstrated through that that were piercing when she did the uh, 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 that bit, like that was piercing that was so piercing and then and then it went up like as she went through the song um before she did any of the what about us like that bit that going up bit there was so clear and so strong and like she was doing something like, i think i even used the word sickening at one point because i'm like this is is that's insane to me that she's just doing these runs like consistently well and yet that was a feeling performance as opposed to a vocal performance. Like... It's people like this that I rate when they're judges on vocal, on vocal talent shows. So I'm like, this is not someone... She, she, she ain't out here pretending to be a singer, do you know what I mean? She's not out here not doing all the different things that she's advising you to do. Like, and I remember when she was, um, when she was a judge on The Voice, I remember saying to um, one of the contestants about, like, 
you want to be able to demonstrate on that stage, yeah? You want every performance to be, like, the sickest performance. Do you know what I mean? It might not mean that you're doing every single riff and run in the book, but you want it to be, like, the sickest performance, that, like, since she stepped on that stage. And I feel like she's got that in her head every single time. When she was talking to the band about how she wanted, like, you know, to, to involve the, the, the crowd and stuff, and, you know, she's got quite clearly a vision in, in her head about what she wants from that performance but how she really wants everyone to connect with what she's singing and you can't tell me that right now and obviously not, this song isn't down to her right but the way in which she sang it the way in which she sang it you cannot tell me that a song like that doesn't scream even louder right now do you know what i mean like the world is pretty crazy at the moment so like having someone that can really like breathe life into a song that well. And obviously we saw that um, Gabrielle did this song recently as well and again he absolutely works that. Um, Jesse, like wow, 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 wow. Like I'm actually mad at myself that I, I could have been watching this for like the last five years and, <laughs> and I haven't known, <laughs> I haven't known. Oh, dude, that's so frustrating. Anyway. Again, I would love to know what you guys thought of this. Um, I can't imagine it's... Well, I don't know. You tell me what you thought of this. You, you now know what I think of this. Um, I thought the arrangement was amazing. Her vocals were sick. Her presence was amazing. Um, I, 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 I'm, I, I'm kind of short of any other words to kind of express how sick I thought that was. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. So yeah, please let me know in the comments what you thought of this. And um, if you did enjoy this, then do please drop me a like and subscribe. That would be fantastic of you. Um, and I also do have um, both a YouTube membership that you can be part of if you want to support the channel in that kind of way. And, and uh, some perks there that can uh, can be attributed to your membership. Um, and I've also got my Patreon as well, which is um, access to lots of early reactions and lots and lots of other perks as well. So um, if you do want to support the channel, that would be amazing. Thank you. But for now, thank you so much for watching with me. And I hope to see you on the next one. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs>